So hello everyone, welcome back to more for Troubleshoot. I am, of course, the Black Shadow. And uh, last time, we had ourselves a little secret mission with the HP. It was pretty fun. And we were going to go to the Magenta Backstreets for our next mission. However, it appears that old Albus has been doing some business um, out the Backstreets with Isaac and has gained information for something interesting. And it's going to recommend that we uh, take the day off. So we're going to do exactly that. I have uh, changed. I have given Albus full motivation for this, by the way. Also worth noting, I have also changed his mastery ever so slightly. He now I've given him body training for extra health, so he is now rocking 1,000 health, which he probably really needs. Should we go see what's going on? Why don't we call it a day? <laughs> Not, well, kind of. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Now, what is going on here? I have no idea. We shall see. Are you breaking the fourth wall? It had been four months since Albus' arrival in the Wind Wall District. During his free time, he searched for people who knew him and his parents ten years ago. With just information in Valhalla, he knew it wouldn't be easy to find. There's some familiar faces. You got Peter and <laughs> you get so many people. Isis Records guided Albus to a street near the resting place of his mother, who died ten years ago. <laughs> I remember you. Luna. This is the newest model. It arrived just yesterday from the East Alliance. It's got 6G network. <laughs> the video's downloaded in the blink of an eye. If you don't want to be outdated, oof. Yeah. <laughs> right. There's an idea. I'll get you on with a 36 month plan. It'll be free. I bet your parents have a good point to me. <laughs> oh, it's like I've gone back in time 15 years. It's all very, very entertaining. Don't need one. Huh. Don't need one, eh? Interesting. Hello. Oh, my face isn't working well. Can you give me directions to this location? So at the end of the street, you'll find a way out to the riverside. About ten minutes. Alright, Bridget. Yeah, I, I, I know. This is a new phone for the Easter Line. It's got 6G internet. 30% discount compared to online prices. <laughs> hey, he told you to get a new phone. Uh Cheers, Peter. No, they are kind of adorable. I mean, no. <laughs> I keep looking at you. <laughs> the day of the Alley family reunion. Yeah, so this is what I've been thinking about. Um, since the last time I played this game. So we obviously had the, there was video 11, it was the Alley Cats. Um, Ray, um, Carter, um, Heise, all the Alleys, and Letton. Um, all those the Alleys, but, um, they don't, they don't look like family to me. Do you? Do you think so? Because I don't. So I'm curious to know what's going on with that. Yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> you didn't mind. A fine lady with elegant, shining, long pink hair caught Anne's attention on her way home. She just stood there passively, putting up no resistance against the gangsters who were starting to become aggressive. Her response was... <laughs> it was added to the situation by contact the police and loudly calling out for help. 
<laughs> you need a cut in line. There's no reason for them to get violent. I would have told Anne she was on a trip with her uncle. He couldn't even get me lunch on time. It's not very nice. Yeah. Anne's a sweetheart, isn't she? It's no fun and I'm bored. Hmm. Wait, didn't she just said she... Yeah, she didn't have one. I'm... F It's crazy, all the characters that we know, like, all around each other. It's just such a crazy world, this. Two weeks from now, the user location? Alright, the reopened Ramji Plaza. Yeah, look at you making friends. Small world in it. It's a small world. Oh, we've been had. We've been had. Uh oh, this could get interesting in a hurry. Holy Christ. Hi, everyone, for the honor of the first moon. It's a trap, it's a trap, it's a trap. It's only about, what, 15 on one? Uh oh. Yeah, I know, right? Spoonists. <laughs> I don't think she gives a shit. So, we have a few options here, what to do. I mean, asking to let it go is not going to happen. This is ridiculous. So let the civvies go. Maybe? We could just charge in. We could try and provoke them. This might be a bad idea. Let's do it. We have to try and cause some confusion here. <laughs> you guys really such pathetic losers. Damn. Truth hurts. You piece of garbage. <laughs> well, that's about to get interesting. Also, yeah, if we provoke and take the aggro, that's the idea. Don't give up. I have never in my 20 something years of playing video games ever see a lose condition. Don't give up. I've never seen it. Oh, by the way, we're still on full difficulty. We are excited, but they are all rage. Holy shit. <laughs> They've got some problems here. Looks like we can talk to them though, and um, maybe tell them to get the hell out of here. Oh, that's a Ms. Ann Macy, it is indeed. Yeah, from the, um, the v VHB Dean me. She wants to help. <laughs> it's too dangerous, we should do as he says. There are 20 of them. Don't worry, Luna. I'll protect you. Mm. Yeah, probably. Well, 
We all witness. That's a good point. We have to go to Ramji Plaza next time. All right. Two years of field experience. This should be most interesting. All right, so Anne has joined us. Nice. Let's go uh, check her out then, I guess. Um, let's have a look. So Anne is Anne Macy. She's only level four. Which is not great. So Anne, you'll remember from uh, things. So let's have a look what the heck she is. I'm guessing she's like a white maid sort of style. She's a shaman. Uh, Taking time using ESP brings about um, either hit chance for every spare vigor. Crit hit chance decreases by every spare vigor. Interesting. She's Earth Mastering. Gets plus 2 SP every turn. And uh, she is Sincere. She SP increases by 5 so every turn. Okay, pretty nice. But yeah, not a lot going on. She does have Fellowship Power, though. Um, which gives her um, extra hit chance for ally insight. Makes sense. Not a lot going on, though. But her abilities here, Starlight Arrow, she's going to do a whole lot. Yeah, she does heal, as expected. She is a healer. Call the Starlight. Uh, removes debuffs from allies. That's pretty good. And uh, Starfall. Her, her, wow, her critical is a heal attack. So basically, that's for sure. She's just a, just a white mage. And Albus is... Got some work to do. So, let's see what we're going to do. Dance, boys. There's freaking 20 of them. This is... This is bad. This is... This is bad. They're all rage, by the way. Quick grasp the situation. Man, we are so fucked here. What am I meant to do in this situation? I have no idea. Windvale's gonna protect from suppression. Getting buffed, of course. Wow, we are. I don't know what we're gonna do here. This is, um... this is a problem. We got Luna here, who, by the way, she is level 36. Holy shit. Alright, and let's get you out of there. And I guess if you can starlight, then uh, then do it. You cannot see anything. Oh shit. Um you're not deep up though. Um, but I guess just heal him up. Might as well. Does that give you Earth um, SP as well? It does. What's on it? What the fuck am I going to do here? It's so bad! Anyway, I go across. This is, um... Complicated. Like it. That is unlucky. 91% miss. Ugh. It's so bad. It's so bad. Well, Albus is not going to take any actions for the rest of this game. Until he dies. It's kind of why I windveiled him while I still could. Because he's about to get shot the hell out. But he's going to get a lot of um, time reductions from all these shots. He is in cover. Get some um, plus 10 for all of them. You notice you watch the time on the right side, so it just keeps creeping up there. 54, 44, 34. But obviously, every time he counterattacks, it's minus 30, so. Also, Fire Veil is about to beat the shit out of him. Uh, this is going to get ugly. Feels, feels appropriate. Feels appropriate. How am I going to defeat 20 guys? What the hell am I going to do here? Am I like, am I meant to lose this? I have no idea. Yep. <laughs> Sorry, 
Fire veil me back into cover. Thanks. <laughs> I love it. And again, wind veil to protecting all these suppression shots as well, which is really useful. Right, so I need to get Anna across. I need to get her to. Um, I just need to get a heal. Do I keep him there? Yes. Shit. Um. This is awkward. I'm really uncomfortable putting you this close. <clears throat> Really uncomfortable. I think the best thing for me to do is to legit run you over here and hope they don't target you. You can't. Oh, that sucks. Um, stand by, I guess. <clears throat> I just could have taken the burn off of him. That would have been nice. Get over here, full cover. Yeah. I guess I'm done. I've got to try and loop my way around this. And what I can do is I can also throw a flash grenade. Hello, all of you guys. Nice. Flash yeah. grenade, six dudes. It's pretty sweet. That's going to help a lot as well. And now he's going to be in cover. He's going to get a big time reduction as well. He's still wind veil protecting the situation. Holy yeah. <laughs> shit. Jesus Christ. I just slaughtered that dude. Hey, what, what was he doing? Lunatic. Good end. Good end. Good end. Pardon the pun. That was awesome. Oh my god. He's hey, just what giving this man actions. Beautiful. Guys, doing? She's got. There's all sorts of things happening with Luna. I don't know what's happening. It looks like they're not targeting Anne, which is good. Well, it's kind of the hope. Provoking them has worked, but they are all pissed. I've got the one piece of cover that's going to keep them alive here. Um. Thing is, I need to like stay next to Anne here. So she can buff me. Man, this is really bad. Oh, I should have grabbed the item first. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Um, I need you to take actions as quick as possible so I cannot use the tornado stash here. Lightning magician? I know someone who could be very interested in that. All right, Anne. Um, I'm just gonna have to hope that they really aren't gonna target you. I, I don't know for sure, but I'm just gonna have to hope that that's the case. Oh. At least it means that Albus can continue to be aggressive as well, and have to use like his potions. Oh, I've got them in a pinch. I'm so pinned down. But again, such a high dodge chance. They're all flash and stuff, which is really beautiful. I'm going to throw another flash grenade here. Or do I wait a moment? No, let's just do it. Let's flash him now. And then just prepare for hell. Rude. Oh, you should not have done that. You should not have done that. Yeah, I won't forgive you for this. Luna's like. <laughs> I see where this is going. I think I know where this is going. Oh, that 
you know? Holy Christ, that was brutal. Marco? What the hell? Who are you? What? The monster at Ramji Plaza? Who are you? You. What is happening here? Give me the chance to save that girl. Basically, I think this was meant to happen. Don't you ever make me point my gun at your head again? What the hell? What is... What is going on here? <laughs> Excuse me? What the fuck? What is happening? Well, hands down. Luna's joined. What is... What is going on here? I have no idea. Um, right. Uh, wind veil, please. What the hell is going on? Luna Estina. She is a slaughterer. <laughs> what the frick? She's with the Vendetta Company, apparently. There's... What in the hell are you? I think we're about to find out. That was a poor decision. By the way, she is like super duper as well. She's dead. Just slaughtered. Yep. Get. Oh, that's the point there. Get her action time as well, 48. Oh my god. She is, um. Look how much time she's just getting back at the moment. This is absolute yeah. madness. That's not very nice, dude. You ought to apologize for that. But yeah, again, I'm pretty sure Anne was, is meant to go down in this fight. I think that's the whole point. And then this triggers. Yeah, she is uh, she's legendary, by the way. Continuous slash... Just basically just murder dudes. Alright then. In you go. She has so many abilities. I don't even know what half this stuff is. And you know what? I don't even care. I don't even care. Double hit. Get wrecked. Oh, she can take extra attacks. How many abilities have you got? Bloodbath, undefeated. Um, gives a extra SP installment. Oh my god. Taking a bleeding type gives it a uh, reduce AT. Increase speed. AT reductions. I mean, this is absolutely absurd stuff, this. This is this is rampage. Absolutely rampage this. That's just Rush these dudes. She's gaining AT for the kills. She's going again. Oh my god. Is she still going? This is just. This isn't even right. She's still going. She's overcharged. 
touched. What the hell? She's running out of vehicle, but who cares? Mangle? I mean, feels bad to be you, buddy. Good night and God bless. Just. This ain't right, everyone. This just isn't right. It's not even fair. Oh, I actually got a miss. <laughs> it didn't last long. Oh, but she's got another action again. Oh, this, this is bedlam. Oh, she's exhausted. No, do me a favor while you're there. Can you open this for me, please? Cheers. You don't need it. She's got major healing potions, by the way, which is pretty awesome. Um, yeah. I don't get to keep it, basically. So, um, I guess Vigor Restore. Wow. She is, um... She's scary. She's very scary. There's a lot to be said here. She's getting like 80 reductions to basically everything that happens. It's so absurd. Ice grenade. No, that's actually not bad. I'll take that. Um, you have nothing equipped for some reason. Sure, put that on. Yep. Get. Energy conversion. If you have damage exceeds 33 HP, lightning has to be increased by 5% of the damage. Wow, that's also pretty good. Found some really cool stuff for Sarn on this mission. No doubt about that. That's some really cool stuff. So I'm curious, if I do this, can I target both of them? I actually don't know. I'm going to try and target the far dude and see if I can hit them both. It looks like I am. That's really awesome. He didn't die. What? That ain't right. Thank you. This poor dude. This poor dude. <laughs> he, did, he didn't realize what he was getting himself into, did he? Brutal. And I'll be alright. Good. Um, I hope not. Um, no. You scare me. Uh, yeah. No. Oh, thanks. Now, I imagine there is worlds where you could possibly try to beat this mission without Anne getting taken down, but good luck with that. I see. Sure, whatever. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? The rest of the case was wrapped up by the police. As I look at the loon, the moment she regained consciousness. Ellis, who was in charge of the site, just shook his head and repeated that she escaped safely. Have been murdered. <laughs> Great. <laughs> she called in a number of news neck message, but she couldn't contact. I was always going to hear anything. Oh, poor Anne. Anne's had it rough this this series so far. Three days later. That's lovely. All the Spooners have been murdered. <laughs> it's correct. 
So this is what we're after, his mother. Yeah. It's been busy. <clears throat> That way to go troubleshooting? I was talking about all that had happened in the last 10 years. How Lily had supported him, the struggles of living by himself, what he had dreamt of all that time. Everything he had experienced as a troubleshooter. Yeah. I'm sure we will. Well, ladies and gentlemen of the audience, that was, that was an experience, to put it mildly. That was an experience. Luna is a, um, a frightening, Frightening individual. Uh, yes. Oh, hello. You're the. <sighs> nice to see the recruiting age is getting younger and younger, eh? You got starting sometime, right? <laughs> Sorry, man. I don't know what that is, but... How you doing, my dear? Hello, troubleshooter. I mean, boss. Yeah. She's not got much else to do, has she? I'm on Silent Side here. Are you sure about that? What are you talking about? Great. This is true. Like, we are so item dependent for all our healing. It'd be nice to have someone who's, you know, not. Even if it's not Anne. Exactly. She knows. She's like, I've got you around my little finger, bitch. <laughs> no. Are you sure about this? She knows, she knows what it's about. Of course. And Macy, I welcome you as a member of Black Shadow Incorporated. We hope you develop whatever abilities you may lack. Sweet. Uh, um. Great. Hey! Tell me what a name or whatever you feel like. Sweet. So there we go. We have our fourth troubleshooter. And young Anne Macy. Who's... She's going to need a little bit of work. But we can address that. And yes, the music is... she is and Macy so let's have a look and see what she's got she has some individual masteries so let's go pick up see what she's got so you have starlight so she was on sincerity which is plus five SP every turn which is not bad like it's basic simple straightforward it's not bad at all well obviously that means you're kind of basing your game around using her special lot, which is maybe not the best thing. So we have Starlight Fragments, which reinforces her attack ability. So it doesn't take as long to cast and have a delay on her, and reduces the cooldown a bit by one. Okay, so it makes her a bit more attack focused. We have Starry Knight. So, depending on the weather, she will get buffs. Interesting.
very interesting. So if it's clear or windy, she gets good blessings. If it's anything else, it's a bit weaker. If you take damage and HP falls below 33% or 25, you gain Starlight Shield. What does Starlight Shield do? I don't know. I have absolutely no idea. But you know what? You got a deal. Alright, and she's gained an extra level or two for her troubles. Alright, so let's go check out Anne a little bit more detail. So she has gained six levels, she's at level 10, so still a bit of distance to cover, but we can make that work. Alright. Just taking it all in here. She's good at synthesizing Psystone. Okay, creamy. So, where do we want to start with you, Anne? Um, can you make your synergy stuff, actually? She's Capricorn. Uh, if you attack the most while covering, friendship all members engaged towards you increases by 100. It feels like sympathy. Oh, wow, I already feel honoured with, um, with Albus. Nice. If Albus is uh, back, then we can also do the same. Have ourselves a proper bond. Sweet. Uh, feel business is her thing. Friendship increases towards five for every one recommended mission level. Interesting. Sweeper, yeah, we know about that. Thank you for the protection. Upon completing the mission, um, if you are not out of action, friendship towards a member engaged in a mission increases by 20. If you gain exhausted or lethargic state, friendship also, um, friendship towards common members decreases. Yeah. Interesting to know. Okay. Sure. <laughs> she's, she's Alright then, so, um, I am trying to think where to start with you. Um, I can't look at any of this stuff, of course, you need to get some experience. Um, obviously having you on 40 SP would be good, but you're only level 10. Oh, this is level 10? I mean, spell nothing. Might as well, right? Add that on. Extra vigor's always good. She's got her brown fox coat, which is okay. Ah, these are the coats you've been finding. You can equip these. Okay. Um, that'd be a bit of extra help, which obviously is a real concern at the moment. She will lose 10 vigor, but the bangle gives that. It gives armor and a bit of block. 10% dodge chance is pretty good. It's a much more defensive coat. I think that's... I do lose... I mean, losing resistance regardless. I think this is better. I think dodging is more important to you than blocking. So I'll give you that. Um, you are earth attacks, so giving you green blade makes total logical sense. So we'll go and whack you with that. Uh, we can boot you up with some stuff I can identify. Um... I mean, you don't really need potions for healing, because obviously you're a healer, so I guess give you a great bigger potion. Um, as for this... I think this just dodge chance is probably the best. I might give you the extractors, though, um, when we need them. Give me a spoon. And she has a couple of costumes. She has a standard one. She also has a white coat. And she has red and black. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> That's pretty serious. Uh, I tell you what, we'll give her the white coat as it kind of goes in with the colour scheme we're doing at the moment. Sounds good to me. Okay, so that's that. Uh, we're going to spend the rest of the video basically just sorting out Irene here, getting us up, and then we'll end it. So if you're not interested in this, then feel free to continue. And I'll see you next time, basically. Uh, let's go ahead and identify all the items we found. Interesting, these guy boots. This could be a use. Nice, at least Anne's up to level 10 at the least, so that's good. Um, so let's see what we're rocking with these boots here. Settler boots. Eh, yeah, not great. They do give good armor, though. I guess these will do for now. And I'll try and give us something a bit more, um... 
Is that a bag or a, like a tailored woman? It's pretty adorable regardless. Now, my dear, you also have a lot of mastery stuff. So let's go have a look at what's going on here. So what have you got? You have Shaman. Gives you plus 20 vigor. Fellowship. Hit chance. Increases per ally in sight. This is to basically make healing more effective. And that's about it. So, we are 100% putting on Yearning. You are going to need this to gain uh, levels as quickly as possible. So, that is just going on immediately to catch up. Now. What kind of stuff would be good for you? And what do I think you have? have on you that would be of use. Anything that looks like it go with the shame and stuff. There's something there with Shaman. I can't do anything with it. Shaman appears on a few of these actually, but I can't I can't feel all of them out, unfortunately. Any of them out by the looks of it. I don't I'm missing something or another. Shaman definitely applies into a few, so that's pretty neat. Else down here. Okay. So, what would I be looking to put with, with this stuff? There's definitely some basic stuff to go alongside. So, what would I put in with you for this? Maximum vigor. Good for you right now, though, is the question. Also, for the record, does anything? I wonder, does anything go with yearning? By the way, do I see anything that has like that unusual symbol for yearning? Fellowship over there. Does of course Eric have? Uh, so I'm pretty sure much every ability has some. It's in some sets. It's interesting looking stuff. I'm trying to see if yearning's on any of these, but I don't know if it would be. Just scouring. I don't know if that works. Uh... No, that's the names of the actual things. Okay, cool. So just, just exploring and seeing. So... Uh, willpower looks logical to give her better magic ability. Of course, that's all she's really about. So let's give her willpower. Seems logical. Um, attack, defense, and ability. So, ability stuff. I don't think she really needs any of that. Defense would be important. Let's look at the attacks. Is there anything here that looks like it would be good? Give her full stormman. I don't mean, I need any of this stuff, so it's basically about defense for now. Um, you stay on your set into that. Lightning reflexes could be pretty good for actually in the heat of things. If I need to run closer to someone, that could be pretty good. Hmm. Spiderweb stunts. <laughs> I think I'm actually going to go ahead and give it lightning reflexes. I think this could be um, useful in a pinch. Maybe even draw out some Overwatch fire, potentially. Is there anything else? HP increases as much as maximum vigor. And the vigor's pretty decent. I'll give it like it's just straight 100 health. That might not be bad, actually. And that might actually be worth Shaman, potentially. What do you want to do to make that? Oh, I need Shaman to make that. Okay. So... And I could do that with Mage. You know what? I'm going to do it. Let's go ahead and make a Shaman. And then we'll go to Abundance. And we'll use that to make... Wait, what? Oh, no. We need a yeah, Shaman to make an Abundance. And we can use a Lightning Reflex to do that as well. Pay for that. All right, cool. And then if we go back to here, we can now put a button on. And I think this will be pretty useful. 
Hey, there is one of them. Warmth of life. At the start of your turn, as in the range which aura and life applies, recover vigor by 10 and the action time decreased by 5. That's pretty neat. All right, but we need a master that we have no idea what it is, which is a shame. But at least we figured that out, so that's good. That's kind of one of the tricks of these games, is trying to work out these sets. Definitely useful. Definitely useful. Um, so, it's going back to this. Have a little look, just to see if there's anything else that I can see here. Yeah, definitely does pair up with these. There's another one here, but we don't have anything for that, unfortunately. Yeah. That's a little bit of a shame. Nothing else that I've got really twosies for. I can make a ton of use out of. Okay. Well, good. We're learning it. Um, which means I still have a couple more slots for you. So I think I still put learning reflexes on you regardless. I've got the training manuals for it. And that means I've got two slots for you. I really don't think any of these is necessary. I just don't see a use for any of these at oh. all. I guess I could just give you pockets. Eh, what the hell, right? Sure, I'm not using them on anyone else. Have um, have some pockets. Give you some extra support stuff. What the hell? Not, no one else is using them. Don't see a problem about that. But I would like that. That would be a really cool little, little buff there. Alright, very nice. So, anything else I want to do with you, my dear? It does encourage me to want to not have you with the bronze spoon, though, and give you, like, actual weapon. Oh, by the way, yeah, here's the guard. It's an actual fate that you've got, like, the spoons. Um, smoke grenade, just have you as the, uh, just as the straight freaking um, support. <laughs> Makes sense to me. Alright, and the idea is obviously with Yearning, um, she's going to gain experience from everyone else doing the work and let her catch up. It's going to take some time for Anne to catch up. She's, she's got some work to do, but I think we can make it work. Alright then, I think that's gone pretty darn well. You have a, uh, a thing, and I don't know why I didn't put it on. Right, I'm waiting for level 22 for that. You know, I don't really have anything else to put on you. Um, any attack that I'm interested in just whacking on? No. Doesn't matter because they'd be dead, <laughs> pretty much. Um, there is some interesting stuff I'd like to put on you, actually. Is it under support? Oh no, there's is basic here. Lightning magician would be pretty sweet. Um, the other thing I'm interested in getting you on you as well is is it under energy conversion? Looks pretty good. Remember, we, of course, picked up some very interesting, very interesting lightning stuff, uh, which makes sense to try and whack on them here. Um, so I think I might actually put energy conversion on and take off bump resistance. This is just on just for the, just for being here. So put on light energy conversion. Who knows? We might find a more set stuff. We did not. You're rocking in a flame, which is uh, making you immune to fire. I kind of want to put something else on for you for that. Don't really need it. Don't need optimism. I don't have anything else to put on you, though. Uh, supporter. Put in getting experience. If there's an ally whose level is less than your level, the ally gets bonus experience which is 50% of the tonal. I see. So it's like the opposite of yearning. Yearning, you just gain 50%. Um, support is like um, the other way around. That's pretty sweet, actually. I might put that on and just look to use that to, uh, and basically just use that to um, increase probably limit of each martial group by one. And just basically just get an extra thing. That could be kind of cool, but I don't really have the training points to justify. Um, yeah, I might put this on. What's it gonna take to make this? And this will help. Um, this will help. Oh, I need all left click, my bad. And this will help um, more here. I need yearning. God damn it. And for yearning, I need adventurer. 
which, am I ever going to use Adventurer? I don't think so. You know what, let's do it. It's fine. Give me a random tactical sense. And then we can use this. Use Envelopment. And now we can put Supporter on, which is going to get... Um, so yeah, basically, freaking... Uh, and it's going to be gaining levels very fast. I am all for this, by the way. I <laughs> am all, all for this. Alright then, I think we're pretty much done here. I don't think there's anything else particularly to do. Uh, while I'm here, let's just quickly go to Shooter Street. Before I end the video, this is all kind of ancillary stuff. If you've if you were going to stop watching this video, you already would have done so. That's not berating you or anything, but it's just me being pretty interesting. We'll just quickly swing the by Super Street and see if there's any more uh, requests or anything. Must have a quick look. So one thing I have definitely noticed about this game as well, about the mastery stuff, like, you could definitely, if you wanted to, just spend literally hours and just basically just keep flicking through different masteries and pairing up to try and find as many sets as you could and mark them down. That is definitely something you do. Oh, by the way, if you press M in this area, you get a mini-map. So you can actually find out where um, quest requests are and that sort of thing. Don't have to go looking. <clears throat> You want bronze spoons, do you? <clears throat> it is indeed. Shove on the sides that are related to Spoonie's case. Yeah. Uh, we've got a few. Uh -oh. <laughs> I see. The material merchants will definitely buy them if the content is high. If it's low, then, you know, what do you do? But should I ask them to buy them all if they are late? It's going to be valuable. It's fine. Yeah. How many do you want? You want five of them. I have seven. Good. Good. Hey, they do present time percentage copper. <laughs> nice. Nice. Alright, so we can get hold of bits and pieces. We're going to take more of the uh, the sets of equipment. I see no reason not to. And again, one day I might use these. So. Nice! There we go. More success. Is there anything else to do here? I don't think so. We've got a few quests, of course, outstanding that we haven't dealt with. Uh, I suppose while we're here, do I want to buy anything for Anne? Maybe see if we got some uh, some better boots for her. Maybe might be not looking worth it. Sure, let's go and um, let's go to the arm. Let's go to Denbell and uh, <clears throat> see what we've got here. Uh, you don't do. Oh, you do do boots. Does um can can Anne use sneakers? The best thing I've got otherwise is this. Just straight resistance and blunt resistance. It's, you know, it's probably better. It's probably better. Yeah, you know, you've got to do Do I want to change your coat at all? I don't think so. The coat you got's pretty decent. That's it's almost virtually the same thing, actually. Um, just slightly different priority of uh, abilities, but uh, piercing resistance plus 184. That's kind of insane. Yeah, we'll buy some boots. Let's get her the um, new boots. Sure. You're welcome. And I suppose while we're here, let's get us some of the stuff. All the green stuff we don't need. And we'll keep these fang of the ball. I just don't want to sell it. That is my trinket. The rest of the game. Uh, I don't think I'm going to use that on you. No. 
No, again, you could definitely also uh, look to scrap this stuff for the workbench, but I'm going to be honest, I don't have much of incentive to go down that route right now because we're going through our levels pretty quick and so our equipment's changing this. Once you get to like high levels, then it might be more worth like putting effort into improving the equipment you've got when you're not changing it as regularly. Get something and you're like, oh, this is really good. But uh, I'll be honest at this point, don't. I mean, bro, I'm just selling it. Get the money. I think it's more important. Um, get rid of those. Are we doing it per page? Because remember there was that time earlier where it was like um, doing weird stuff? Yeah, I remember that. I don't think I need any of this stuff. Let's go. Uh, I probably don't need that many great healing potions. We can sell a few of those. And... I think that's fine. Cool. Nice. Thank you. Okay. Roster and boots. Travel boots. Yes. I lose a tiny bit of hit chance. Who the hell cares? Worth it. All right, then. So, that is awesome. So... The only question I have now is what is the mission that I next mission I want to do? Because I don't know if I really want to be getting. Wow, there's a lot of stuff going on here. We've got several story missions, by the way. Uh, Harbor Docks, um, the Forest Way here. This is the next mission we were gonna do, but like that's ex very hard, super hard. Um. So there's a lot of story missions to go. We've got some side stones here, by the way. Stone and green and such. But uh, I think this might be the way we go here. We've got a defense mission um, down the Ashen Harbor. Uh, we've not done one of these before. This could be interesting. Level 14 is not outrageous either. Um, is this a story mission? I think it is cast as story missions, um, I believe. He just also has requests up, but I believe the red means it is a scenario case, which means, of course, it's on cruel mode. Oh, <laughs> uh, Alright, thanks. We'll that. So, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I think we'll do one last video tonight. I've been recording all day, taking advantage of this. You gotta do. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you all next time for Final Mission of the Session.